Hey, we're here with Jordan van Forest. You just won your game. How do you feel? Yes, pretty happy. Um, it was a crazy match, so really happy to finally pull through with the win and be able to stay in Berlin for at least like two more days, I guess. Okay, so now just imagine you are the field president. What would you change in a chess world? <laughs> That's quite a big question after two blitz games. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I was not prepared for. I should have prepared for the questions maybe as well today. Um, what would I change in the chess world? Oh, there's probably many things to be changed. Let me, um, I cannot come up with anything. <laughs> There's so much you want to change, so you don't know? No, I'm just completely caught off guard by this question, so. Um, okay, let's just go with another one. Yes. So you play a lot of online chess, right? Yes. Can you get really mad or angry? Um, I usually stay pretty calm. I, I don't think I've ever broken a mouse. Maybe I've, I've hit the table a fair amount of times. So, but I know there's people who have broken like their mouse or um, smashed maybe even the computer. I don't think I've gone that far personally. So I, I smack the table sometimes really hard when I make a mistake. But I usually stay pretty much in control. So you said there's someone who destroyed their mouse. Who was it? I've heard stories, let's say. <laughs> okay, next one. What's the last book that you read? Oh, also another good question. <laughs> you can go with chess or with something different. Not the last book. I, I don't read chess books. Um, oh. Okay. Um, I'll go with uh, The Spy and the Traitor. It's about Oleg Gordievsky. Okay, next one. What's the greatest sin in chess? Greatest sin in chess? I don't like people who offer super quick draws. That's the greatest sin for you? That's right now the sin I can come up with. 